Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a what's on my iPhone because I got a new iPhone and I asked y'all what spring kind of videos you guys wanted to see and this was one of the videos that I got requested to do. Um, I might do more spring videos, I really don't know. But yeah, today I'll be filming my what's on my iPhone and I think I might be doing a how I edit my Instagram pictures at the end or towards the end, but I need to like hurry this up because my camera's about to die and I don't want it to be too long with the how I edit my Instagram pics and what's on my iPhone, so we're just going to go ahead and get started. I'm sorry for like my hand writing on my hand, just this one. Um, I have some like ink from art and then I have like math homework written on it because I forgot my agenda for class, so just excuse that. But anyways, this is my iPhone. I have the white, uh, not white silver iPhone 5s and it looks like this it's super pretty I did not want the gold so I got silver and I took off my case but the case I usually have on is the spec case and I got it for my birthday so yeah um, this is my phone and my background is a picture off of tumblr and I have a password I'm just gonna use my thumb so this is my iPhone. This is what you first see when you unlock my phone and then you slide and there's some folders and that is everything. So I'm going to start up here and work my way down. So up here I have FaceTime, calendar, photos, and then I have camera, weather, clock, maps, videos. I only I have notes, iTunes, app store, settings, mail, which I don't check because it has all my YouTube stuff. Then I have Safari and then I have this folder and it's extras. And just, you know, stuff that you don't use. So I have calculator, or my script calculator. And it's pretty much just like this kind of thing. Like you write, and it's called my script calculator. Then I have find my iPhone, contacts, calculator, passbook, all that stupid stuff that I don't use. Then I have Instagram, and my Instagram is MorganXOXXO. Then I have Snapchat, and this is private, so I'm not going to give that out. Then I obviously have YouTube, and, and then I have Vine, but I don't post anything, so I'm not going to put that out there. Then I have phone messages, Twitter, my Twitter is MorganXOXXO, then I have music, and, you know, just music. To my second um, screen, I don't know, I have my editing apps, I have Afterlight, Reflection, ViscoCam, Photo Collage, ca Characters, um, Characters is just like little things this is how I get my like really weird emojis um on Instagram and you just like do whatever you want and then you can copy it whatever you want to do I have a very I don't even know I don't use this I never used it really so I don't know um I have square ready which is just like the white background I'll go over all of these when I show how I edit my pictures so then I have Entertaining, and I have Pandora, Netflix, Shazam. So like if you hear a song you don't know, you can like touch it and it tells you what song it is. Then I have SoundCloud, which is like free music. I have Flappy Bird, and I have Octagon, and this game is so addicting. Um, you have to pay $2 for it, but I think it's free on your computer, and it's the best game I've ever played. It's so addicting, like... It's the best game ever. That's it in this folder. And then I have social. And I have kick. And my kick is Morgan XOXXOO. And I honestly don't check my kick anymore. Because I don't have that much time. So like I'm sorry if you see your name on here. And I haven't responded. But this is my kick. And I will try to get to these. Once I finish this video tonight. Because I have nothing better to do. Then I have Ask a Fem and the link is in my Twitter bio. Then I have Google Translate for like Spanish. Then I have Keek, which is like 36 second videos. And my Keek is Morgan Hundorf. And then I have Winello. And then I have my channel, which is just like a link to my channel on YouTube. That is everything on my phone. I hope you guys enjoyed. And by the way, I don't have Tumblr on my phone. Because I didn't want to use up a bunch of space on my new phone. But I had Tumblr on my old phone. And I have a Tumblr. And it's just MorganXOXXO if you want to go look at my Tumblr page. 
so yeah this is my what's on my iphone and now let's get into how i edit my instagram picture so the main editing app that i use is visco cam or after light and i'll put the little like pictures and the name right here or whatever wherever and i'm going to show you guys what it looks like now i'm going to take a picture and we're going to edit it Okay, so I just took a picture and this is on ViscoCam and it has a little library where you can import pictures to edit and I already have this one selected, the one that I just took and you press this little like editing little thing and it gives you a bunch of filters and you can like adjust them. The main ones that I use are FT and black and white because I use a lot of black and white filters or I use T1. And I found this app through Makeup by Mandy 24, so if you saw her video, then yeah, this is where I got it from. Go ahead and use the filter T1, and then you can press this little arrow button, and press this, and you can like edit the exposure and all this kind of stuff, you know, like contrast and tints and everything. And then you press this, you press check once you get the edit you want, and it edited it. And then you can press this button down here to export wherever you want it. Okay, so that is the main editing app I use. And if I don't use that, then I use Afterlight. But I don't really just use um, ViscoCam. And um, I think ViscoCam is free, but I don't know. Okay, so I took a picture, and I'm going to go edit it on Afterlight. Okay, so I opened up the app, and I'm going to go ahead and take that picture that I just took. You press use. And here it is. I'm going to press this. This is where the edits are. This is mainly what I use it for. And I mostly use Finn, Russ, all this kind of stuff. Because it gives like, you know, that kind of stuff. And it has a lot of different kinds of edits. Most of them are just, you know, like the neutral, not, you know, bright, whatever kind of edits. And here's like the black and white and all that kind of stuff. So it's a really great app and I really like the effects but I do use visco cam more and then you can put like a little box on it like an outline that kind of stuff and yeah you can like center you know all this kind of stuff which is pretty cool but I don't use it that much and then once you're done editing which I didn't edit at all you can go and save it on your camera roll by pressing done at the top okay so then I have reflection and I don't use this as much as I used to but you can take a picture and take that one I used earlier and you can like make a reflection and you can pick which way you want it say I want it that way this way all that kinds of stuff then you can like choose like how much of the other side you want in it so like I usually go all the way so it has like the whole picture in it and then you can just save it. The collage app that I use is Photo Collage. And you can just, you know, pick out your format and make a collage. Pretty self-explanatory. Characters, I already showed you guys this. You can get little, like, emojis that they don't have. Like the... Oh, go away. Okay. So, like, this little heart I usually use it for... Or the crown that I used in that one post on Instagram. All that kind of stuff. It has really cool emojis that Apple doesn't. Then I have Avery. I honestly don't even use this. I never use this. But, you know, I guess you can try it. I never used it, so I can't really say much about it. The last editing app is Square Ready. This is how I get my um, background my white background and you can just like center it wait uh, you can like center it however way you want this is really comfy like it's really annoying though how like it always has this stuff pop up when you move it so that is mostly how i edit my instagram pictures but if you want you can go on my instagram and see more of my pictures and most of my recent ones like my recent 10 have been editing edited with visco cam and square ready so that's mostly what i use I hope you guys enjoyed this video, found it helpful, got some new apps that you like. Don't forget to follow me on my social media. They're always listed down below. And I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!